faithful. Our God, the Christ Jesus, has commanded us in his wisdom to cleanse this den of heresy and witchcraft. And though our times have been difficult, we have at every turn prevailed. We have slain the heretic witch, witch giant, and we have claimed the heretic witch giant sword. Who now can question or oppose us? Who? Ha 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 ha, the power. Uh, all right, that's enough. Hi, welcome back to Working Project Title. I'm Scream Name Pending, your uh, host in this hour. Blind, fast travel free, always online, always good vibes, play through of Elden Ring. And yeah, we're still doing our little Crusader cosplay. I, uh, this outfit's fun. Comes with a whole character concept. <laughs> uh, <laughs> don't know why, when I decided that, but I did. Uh, but yeah, we're still here in Carrion Manor. Um, I think we're getting pretty close to being done it, right? We've been through most of the corners. We've now seen the top floor and the bottom floor, and we're at like a third level, which I assume is where we're going to find uh, our final challenge here. So uh, you're, you're finding me uh, literally right where we left off last time. I uh, haven't even healed or anything, so I've still only got half uh, potions. But you know what uh, You know what we say here on, on Working Project Title? Uh, high stakes, Dems to breaks. Yeah. yeah. Cool. <laughs> you know, you can't become Elden Lord without breaking a few Elden eggs, I always say. Uh, so, oh, I thought, I guess I hadn't killed these guys on this particular life. Oh, wait, which I guess means that I have a half-decent amount of souls here. Let me just yoink. Yeah, all right. Okay, cool. Because, yeah, probably one thing we're going to do... I mean, as I mentioned, if you've, anyone who's been following this channel at all knows that we are fast travel free, fastidiously. We, uh... Torrent earns his paycheck. Um, but, uh... We do use it to go to the one place that, as far as I understand, cannot be gotten to uh, without it. Which is to say... Ah, uh, round table hold. Which, uh, we might, we're probably gonna make a little pop in there, now that I see that we do have some souls, uh, to just, I don't know, uh, check on things, but I was gonna hopefully upgrade a couple of my ghosts, uh, at this point. I've, I've got some favorites, I have, I have decisions. This is not me, uh, this guy has already had his chance. You know, rules of the playthrough, I guess catching people up, because we've been getting some subscribers lately, uh, is that w w pacifism's a very strong word, but you know, we, uh, I, I don't believe in killing anybody who has not been confirmed to be an enemy combatant. Uh, which means I generally don't backstab unless I've killed someone previously or they've tried to kill me before, more importantly. Uh, and yeah, we don't fast travel. We're always online, although I, that doesn't mean that we're ever invaded. We're, we're like, I'm pretty far into this game now, and I still don't. As far as I understand, invasions would be happening if I was calling for help, but I'm not generally calling for player help. I don't know. That feels like a you know past first playthrough thing to do to me. Um, I mean, you know, it's not, the communications are limited enough that people can't really spoil things for you, but it's still different than being alone, even. When you can summon NPCs, it's still still different. Doesn't feel the same as having a human player with you. It can, changes the tone, you know. Uh, I mean, I wonder how they died. I have solved the mystery. Uh, okay, there is a way to go there, though. I guess that, <laughs> that tells me that much. I mean, there must be, or else there would, wouldn't. Uh, oh, there's a jar man down there. Is it the friendly jar man that I know? Probably not, because he's somewhere else. Uh, and then there's something. Something else going on over there? What am I seeing there? Uh, angle on the... <laughs> can't go below like a 45. Uh, but yeah, so the... So the um, yeah, rules of the playthrough. We, uh, you know, fast travel, we stay online. Uh, and yeah, so if there's anyone out there who wants to shout out, is there something I can do to be invaded? Other than call for help? You know, don't spoil anything, but like... I, I consider that part of the difficulty of the game, uh, the, the, the Dark Souls, Dark Souls 3. I anyway, I don't know if I've actually played with any seriousness. Uh, I, I, I like it. I know it's mean and ganky and whatever, it's usually... But usually you have, you know, you're not always invadable, but there's some circumstance that creates it, you know. Spoilers for Dark Souls 3, but in that one it's being embered or not. Uh, okay. Oh. So what I was about to say... Have I reached the inner sanctum? I think maybe I have. Uh, is that... Uh, unfortunately, I didn't like... I kind of hope there'd be a bonfire. 
Surely they don't make you fight the giant twice to get to it. I mean, I guess I do know you can sneak by on it. But yeah, I kind of wanted to go to Round Table Hold. Try summoning. Hmm. Uh, before we c confront the, the queen of this place, whatever her name is. I know it's another R name. Note to George R.R. R. Martin. Fucking writer's trick 101. Don't you, There are like 24 letters in the alphabet. Or 20, 27? 20, well, never, never mind. I'm a smart person. There are a bunch of letters in the alphabet, and don't name two characters the same thing until you have run out of goddamn letters. You, you, it helps the brain remember names. Radon, Ren, Renata, Ren, Radich. Everybody's got an R name, except for the people who have M names, and all of them sound like they're Irish clans. McSomething, McKayla, Mc, McQuimby. Uh, that's a big old thing. So yes, these people, it would seem, were the masters of astrology, the old kind of magic that is like no longer as she, I guess, anymore. This is cool. This place is eerie. Um, <laughs> just getting the lay of the land before I trigger what is inevitably going to happen here. Um, if this is the boss fight, though, yeah, I kind of wanted to talk to... Oh, well. Because um, I can only come back here to a fire, which means I didn't do all that work I just did. Because... Um, what I, who I am already calling Ulfnir the All-Knowing, although I don't, he doesn't officially call himself that to me yet, but the intro did, uh, is he, he, he had a little primer on all of these bosses, and I forget this lady's deal. She's the princess of this place. I don't know. She likes magic. She, uh, again, something to do with the, the, these people were very into the astrology shit, apparently, and they have presumably therefore built the astrolabes that we have been seeing. No item ahead. Praise the message. And then something incredible. I don't believe you. But what if? <laughs> this is, this is, this is like, wow, 6,000 people did it. They can't all be wrong. Damn. <laughs> and folks, that's how uh, mass hysterias happen. What's that? That was that was me teaching you a lesson. Okay, I'm gonna walk into the middle. Royal Knight Loretta. Hello. Yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and get on this side of that. Okay. Yep. Yep. I know that move. It's a pretty good spell. It's not my favorite one, but I I like it. I, I slotted it. Shit. Okay. Not really wearing, wearing magic resist gear, nor am I even wearing boss fighting gear. Okay. Didn't really expect this to be so close. It's concerning. Um, am I going to get really chintzy here and try to do a bunch of urgent heals in combat? This is gonna, I'm going to end up regretting this. If I take even one hit. Uh, so far I haven't done... Oh, okay, there we go. There it happened. Whoop. This guy does just seem to basically be a mage knight, though, of, like, a type I've seen before, essentially. He's got, like, a little more health bar, and he's got, like, two spells instead of, like, a spell. But even they, I think, have that sword thing. Ow, shit. Uh, whoop. Oh, god, that was pretty bad. Okay, drinking. Whoa, hey. Man. Ooh. Okay, we gotta press. We gotta press this guy harder. <sighs> He's a spellcaster. I need to make him give me ground, not the other way around. No! Ow, that was dumb. Just took that full in the face like a doofus. Hiya! Oh boy. Hiya! Hiya! Okay. Hmm. Ah, shit. Yeah. Ooh, haha, <laughs> you missed. Okay, didn't expect the second. Uh. Uh, uh, uh. For times like this, I wish I had a homeward bone. <laughs> of all the times to be fucking- Ah, oh, shit! I saw that coming and it still didn't work. I'm not going to try to urgent heal. That'd be stupid. It's not going to get me anywhere. In front of you with all your lasers trying to... Oh, stand here and heal. I'm going to regret it like crazy. 
taking it on the shield like a boss. That was <laughs> not tenable. Uh. Okay, god damn it. You have all the times to have... have <laughs> shouldn't have uh, powered up there. Yep. Yeah. Uh, should have... Uh, mm, forgot I anticipated that maybe there'd be a boss. Mm, that's a shame. Oh, I see. I get a stake. Um, yeah, I... Um, yeah, let's just go to the side of Grace. I'm gonna, I'm gonna potion up and stuff, I guess. I guess I'm gonna treat this guy like a boss fight. I'm not convinced he's the final boss. He's not, what's her name? So I guess maybe he's like a mini boss. I guess he's like a gate boss. Still, let's boss gear up. Uh, which means basically just this. Just because, yeah, healing in combat, especially against a caster like him, unthinkable. Uh, oh, really? Is this how far back I go? Oh, shoot. I forgot how far it really was. Um, still, though, this is like a nearly combat-free walk-up. So let's just do it, I guess. Um, unless I get that dog. You look at me, dog. These guys are pretty low aggression. Oh, there he goes. Okay. Or, you know, a wolf, who you presume would have a pretty good sense of. These guys are weird encounters. They really are. Um, just because... Like, look at that health bar. But you still not... Ow. Hard, exactly. Use a shoulder weapon. But yeah, God. Just, like, sawing through him like a... Uh... Gyro... <laughs> You know, things they have at Shwarma Hut. <laughs> Just like sawing through a big log of meat. Uh, okay, so that giant is back. The giant is back. Okay, but I can I can do this. I've already espied this. Badoop, boop, boo, badoop. Uh, uh, already identified this route before I fought him. And yeah, it actually kind of just lets you circumnavigate this whole thing. Just have to fight this is a dude. Uh, and then if I go up this way, I don't even have to fight that guy over there, I don't think. I do think I have to fight the crossbow guys. Hi, you. You were identified as a hostile combatant in the previous run. <laughs> Again, it's not murder. That was self-defense. It was just a preemptive sort of self-defense. Uh, and then if I go this way, I actually only have to fight one of them. May as well. <laughs> Two on the other side. Oh. Well, well. Look at you. Hitting me. This long weapon is really too much. Too much weapon for these little chumps. Eh. I wanted that proc too badly. I should always just let him bounce off of my shield if he wants to. Okay, so now I'm going to top off with the mana bar that I got. Let's, uh, let's do this right. I missed this the first time, huh? I don't think these respawn are just a one-time kind of plant. There seem to be both. Uh, okay. Yeah, we're not casting in combat anyway. Alright, let's hit it. And I guess let's uh, show our physic. Oh, it's that one. Okay, took one of them there, but that's not a big deal. Things don't actually hurt that much. No, Ow. Each one doesn't, anyway. Is the quick weapon any better? I don't actually think so. I think I like the long weapon for you. Kind of high up there. Oh. Damn it, that was bad timing. That was even worse! Come on, keep moving, keep moving. And... Okay, good. Drink. Really? Crap. Yeah. Stole my Elden Shard, <laughs> bastard. I'm gonna kill you for that. Ow. No, come on. I can do better than that. Whoop. Whoop. Uh huh. Oh shit, shit, shit. Don't have. I should have known better than that. The shield doesn't really give me much protection here. Ow, fuck. Ow, double fuck.
double. Fuck. Just for the first one on that one, I'm, I'm doubling the cost of all the ah, fucks that you give me. <sighs> Ow. Come on. Okay. Okay. Ugh. Oh, man. Why, why are you making me get so serious faced with you, man? You're not... Come on. You're just a knight. Ugh. He's just one man. He's just a stupid knight. Okay. Just a stupid knight with stupid knight moves. I've seen this crap. Okay. No. Oh! <laughs> Embarrassing. Okay. <sighs> no. Yes. I don't really want to drink yet. No, okay, now I need to. Oh, okay, fuck it. <laughs> hmm. I just had a thought. All right, give me a second here. All right, the, the witch fighting gear makes its triumphant return. This is actually not at all the same outfit as it used to be. I got some changes since then, but this is me maximizing magic defense in a bunch of different ways. Uh, this guy still obviously does a fair amount of physical, so I don't want to get too cocky, but uh, this, this shield is great against everything. That's why we use it. Uh, I'm gonna try this one more time. I haven't been treating this guy with sufficient respect, so excuse me, sir. You know, I haven't really been thinking about you and what you represent, but here, let's just, this will be a little test of our systems. Yeah, like, well, I didn't stop 100% of it, but stop. But now, now this shield went up, actually stops those flying magic daggers. Now we're talking, you know? That old wood shield did essentially nothing to magic. You know what? I'm not grabbing those souls. Because I respect you. Because you're a real boss. Nah, I lied in souls. You're not a real boss. Whoop. Whoop. And also I'm going to try to use... Yeah. Ho 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 ho. Uh-huh. Just going to stand here and drink, eh? Ow. Uh-huh. And now we just keep moving a little bit. There we go. Okay. Yeah, holy works on ghosts. You're a ghost something. Or an illusion. I don't... Ow. Oof. All I know is that it's witch shit, and I don't approve of it. Ugh. And the Lord Christ Jesus... Well, we're not cosplaying anymore. We're just killing witches. This is business. Ow. Ow. Fuck. Mm. <sighs> You're on working project title. Witches get stitches. Ow. Ow. Uh-huh. Yeah, you suck. Ah. That looks like a wind-up for an actual attack, but instead it just deploys the things which then attack me, so I end up kind of like <coughs> fail dodging four or five times in a row. So I guess we'll waste time right at his feet. Ugh! Feels real bad. I don't like it when that happens. Yeah, there it is again. I'm trying to learn to recognize it. Whoa. That was a lot of bullets. Yeah, this is it. And now I'm kind of stuck in this situation I've created. You're, yeah, you dodge too early. You've lost your opportunity already, and you're just going to have to keep dodging until those daggers finally land. Yeah. Ah, fuck me. I'm doing it again. Ugh. I don't back dodge because their track actually works with that. Yeah, the side move. 
God damn you. You love to leap away. I hate it. There we go. That time I used it right. And then I move. And then I attack again and again. And again. No. Okay. Oh, something new is happening. Is he just powering up his spells? Is that really all there is? Whoa, to it? I guess sort of. Okay, he's got a whole litany of new spells now. That's fun. Cool. All right. Ow. Whoa, yeah, that's a fun and annoying move. You just have a laser on the back of your stick now. Okay. Oh, what? Really? Oh, really? <sighs> Should I be torrent fighting? May I be torrent fighting? He's allowed to be on horseback. <laughs> can I be on horseback? Is that a thing we can both be doing? Um, you know, what are the rules vis-a-vis -vis that? I don't actually know. Uh, just had a thought. Okay, so I think, I bet... Can I slot? Still no. What what can I wear that will keep me heavy? Because I, I, I want to pile some armor along with this, you know? I feel like I'm splitting the difference a bit more effectively. Let's try this. Let's try this. Um, but yeah, serious question. Can I horse up in here? Cannot. Okay. Still not summoning. Don't need it. Don't need it. I don't need it against you. I don't. I'm sure of it. Okay, I'm gonna try to get my physic off real quick here. Oh shit. Come on. What? I thought... Okay, you can just do that throughout the whole battle. You just hadn't been choosing to until last time. They just get bigger. The, the beam he shoots was bigger in Phase 2 last time, but unless he keeps moves across incarnations or whatever, he, seen, he, do, he did actually have that move in Phase 1. He just wasn't using it for reasons unknown. Whoa! Okay, that was a little awkward. Ah, shit. Okay. Oh, I guess he had... I mean, maybe I just didn't... Anyway. I think it had been happening. I'm just not marking this guy's animations right. I had thought his magic missile was different than that, but those are the same thing. Okay, no. No! You know, I also have a ghost horse. I don't understand why you get to have a ghost horse in here, and I don't get to have a ghost horse in here. I'm not even saying that I want to. I'm just, just mad. It's not fair. Ow. Outright. <laughs> when you stand there, he does that. Fair enough. Ha. Ah. Uh huh. I'm gonna drink at the moment. May as well take it. Ah ha. Okay, you. Yeah, contemptible witch. God damn it. Ooh. Motherfucker's making me sweat. All right. Okay. So what have I learned? First of all, I'm a doofus. He always has the magic missile. That's that's all that is. That's just the magic missile. He just powers up in phase two. I'm not sure if the spell he casts on himself is just what gives him all those new spells. Either way, though, though it's it's not. It's it's an opening, and I need to capitalize it on it. I don't know if he has to do that first, or if it's a buff he gains in addition to the other spells, or if it's a buff he has to cast to get those spells. It's not really clear to me, but either way, he casts it at phase two, and I should take that chance. 
Um, what else have I learned? Again, I do think that the holy buff was increasing my damage a lot. I should remember to use that. Okay. Here we go. 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 Whoop. Okay, he's gonna do that. We're just gonna move and move and okay. Okay, he's doing it again. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Whoop. Alright, use the holy. Dream with respect. That means not picking up souls. Picking up souls is what you do when you're farming. You are boss fighting today, Kending. You didn't come here expecting you to be boss fighting right out the gate, but that's what you're doing, so live with it. Ow, shit. No. No. Okay. No! Drink. Uh-huh. Yourself. Oh! Thought he was missing me there. I was wrong. Oh no! That couldn't have gone much worse. That thing really hurts when it hits, doesn't it? Horse feet. Nope. Oh, well, I got one hit him. Take it. Oh, he can just do that from like danger close range, eh? That's fun. <laughs> uh huh. No. No. <sighs> mm hmm. Yes. You're mine. Again. More. No. No, my laser. Oh, no. I was too fixated on getting that charge up. I was trying to get it for a really long time there, and I wasted a lot of. Okay, have I learned anything else? Um, I could be summoning. I won't. Um, I, I want to switch to a faster weapon, but nothing will have the reach. I could be trying the big sword, I guess. I kind of like the pokey stick for this fight, honestly. I came in here just cause, with it just because it's what I happen to be using, but it's one of my most upgraded weapons, so it's not like I'm oh, disadvantaging myself by using it by any stretch. And, uh, ah, ha, ha, ha. Uh, I actually like it for a guy who fucking dances so much. Every time he holds still, I can just, yeah, poke, poke, just punish it so nicely. Oh, whoa, that was, that was great. That was just great. No, really? Okay, 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 okay. I need to collect myself. You know, just have a little think. Because, I mean, I'm sure you could hear that. I want to go back and listen to my own audio there of just how much I was hammering on the dodge button. That is not... You're not thinking anymore, Pending. You're just acting. And that's that's only good when you're in a flow state. And you clearly are not in a flow state right now. All right. But hoo-ha. All right, let's get a little stretch. Oh, yeah, you know, you just got to kind of like reset your muscle memory a little bit. Okay, okay, okay. And then come back to it as a person who is about to win. That is the mentality you want to have as you're walking through the door, because that's the mentality of the guy who wins this fight. Okay. Yep, no. Nope. Okay, we're good. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm going to back up. Uh-huh, and then... Doing fine, doing fine. In, yep, nope, nope, backing up a little bit, let that happen. He's gonna shoot again, no, he's gonna do that again. Let it happen more, drink. 
And yes, that was close, but we're good. Nope. Okay, we're good. Yep. Again. No. Okay, we good. And yes. Okay. No. Damn. Damn it. Why did you do that? Pending. Keep moving. Keep moving. Keep moving. Keep moving. Okay. Keep moving. Keep moving. Keep moving. Drink. Okay. Once again, do not dodge when he summons the swords. Indeed, do the opposite of dodging. Stab him in the face twice. That's Those, those two things are the opposite elements of the, the great wheel of time and eternity. In the beginning, there was dodging, and its counterpart being stabbed in the face twice with my halberd. And these two forces began the dance that would be the universe. Ah! It is the endless fornications out of dodging and her consort being stabbed in the face twice by my halberd that have begotten all of the things of the earth and heavens. And now you know the rest of the story. <clears throat> and again. And now with this. Woo, that was kind of lucky. Okay, let's move now. Oh, that's how that's going. <laughs> no. <laughs> yes, drink. All right, let's just start again from where I was drinking there, right? Oh, I thought that was the other one. Just here, exactly the right angle where the horse can't kick you. There's a spot. Oh, yeah, you just keep doing that, man. Ah, ha, 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 ha. Oh, that's interesting. I don't think you're going to enjoy this corner as much as you think you are. Oh, ooh. Can give a little room. Oh, man, he is really boxed in. Damn it, damn it! Come on! Alright, well that's one way to gain some ground. Yep. Good. He's against the wall again. Yeah. Oh. Okay. I am the Halberd Master. You are not. Yeah. Loretta's Great Bow. I guess that's your Great Bow. Royal Knight or Loretta. We hardly knew ye. Uh, Ash of War, Loretta's Slash. All right, cool. I got both of her moves. Thanks, Loretta. Uh, inventory. Equipment? Uh, well, sorry. Let's, 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 let's check those out real quick. So one of them was an Ash and one of them was a Spell. Uh... Sorcery of the Royal Knight Loretta creates a great magic great bow that fires a great arrow. I mean, wouldn't it? Enhances potency. Hold to... Charging enhances potency, excuse me. Hold to keep the great arrow knocked. It was said that the bow was Loretta's favored weapon. I mean, that she didn't use it as much as the staff. Uh, and then there was an ash. Loretta's something. Loretta's... Nonsense. Some sort of magic thing, I'm sure. Yes. Uh, this Ash of War grants the armor and the magic affinity and Loretta's Slash, a skill of Loretta the Royal Knight. Leap forward, imbuing the blade with glintstone, then descend, accelerating into a sweeping slash. Usable on pole arms and twin blades. Interesting. Um, although I don't really do pure magic. It's, it's int-based and therefore scales poorly. I'll take these zero souls now that we're done boss fighting. Uh, and yeah, so I guess that means we have a neat 10k, which is kind of... Well, that was, I mean, that was in our plans anyway, and now we've got a fire here. That was clearly not... Was that it? I Come to think of it. So I kind of assumed, before we finished with this place, because um, there is... that we would find some way of either getting into the deeper part of the Carrion Hall, which we need some sort of magic key for, or I would get a way to get through the big blue wall door things. Door walls. The things that block my path. Um, but I have killed her and gotten neither of those? Did I, did I miss a third item that she dropped? I'm sorry. There's no magic key? 
or whatever? Did I miss something there? She she didn't, it would seem, drop any kind of magic item or whatnot. She dropped a spell and a, and a thing. So how do I... Huh. It's her... Oh, okay. Oh, okay, there's a second door. There's a second door. All right, well, that'll surely solve these mysteries. I guess. But uh first and foremost, as I was saying, let's um let's teleport to the only place that we teleport to ever because the only way to get there is to teleport there. So I guess you know, it's just a place we keep in our pocket is sort of the head logic here. Uh Sorry, just making sure that um Miranda again, M name. There are too many. I'm sure she didn't have anything to say or whatever. She hasn't piped up in quite a while and we're we're progressing. Uh, so, yeah, we're going down to the Table of Lost Grace. Because um, I've learned to never, ever do this off camera. Like, normally I would just, you know, do it when it comes to, like, shopping and stuff. But, uh, oh, yeah, because every time I come here, something weird has happened. That's weird. Enter Coliseum Combat? What? Why? What? Huh? What happened? How did that change? How come? Coliseum combat. I don't... I assume that's a PvP thing. Cool. Uh, I, I've unlocked PvP combat? When? Due to what? See, this is what I'm talking about. Every time I come here, man. Huh? Boo? You know? How come? Okay, well, we already thought what was down there. I'm not going to completely re-explore this place, just because I don't want to retread old ground too much, but... Just uh, seeing if any of these people have anything to say that they haven't said before. Um, my usual faith trainer is off hanging out with a gold mask now. I do know where that is, although getting there is not exactly easy. Um, hi, you. Yeah, one of the reasons I wanted to pop in here, though, is to get a little refresher. You. What is it? Uh, Renala. Is that her name? Yeah. Yeah. Towering over the mist laden lands of Lyernia. Renala is queen of the Carian royals who govern the academy. Uh huh. Okay. Great room dwells within the egg. Egg. Yeah, right. She has an egg. Which was. Which was what again? <laughs> I'm sorry, why? Wait. What's wrong with Nephi? Oh, yeah. You've already heard. Yeah, she was like. Huh? So I had no further use for her. Oh. Honestly, what's a man to do? A determined plebeian is more wicked than an almond horn, quite frankly. Plebeian? I suspect that's just what the queen wants. A dose of ambition to incite the tarnished. Oh, okay. Yeah, we, um... We did pass Nephili having kind of a tortured moment or whatever in the basement earlier. So I guess she and him are finally not getting along. Good for her, says I. Maybe I should go check on her. Uh, well, let's go over here first where um, this charming fellow hangs out. I guess he already told me to go away, so I guess he probably doesn't have much more to say. Whatever, I don't like him anyway. Hi, ladies. Uh, do I have ball bearings to offer you? Bone peddler's ball bearing. Wait. Oh, well, let, let's just look at that real quick. Ball bearing of an unfortunate bone peddler was slain by the ball bearing hunter. Offer the twin maidens in the round table hold to gain access to thin animal bones and have to be used bone. Right, yeah. We got this for killing the ball bearing hunter, who is the guy who lives in the ash trainer's house at night for some reason. Okay, so now I can buy animal parts. Good for me. That's not really that interesting. Is there anything else that does for me? Um, again, U.S. Smithing Stones 3 and 4, because we found that ball bearing way up in the Altus Plateau. Um, oh, you do have a few more stone sword keys. I didn't realize that. Um, I would be emptying myself out to try to buy them and then some, but... Uh, oh, okay. Uh, maybe I will do that real quick, though. I'm just gonna... Just because, again, I don't pop by here that often, except when I'm on camera, only because 
who knows what might happen. So I'm going to quickly eat an extra 1,200. Sorry, I have 10,000, 2, 4, 6, 8. They were what, 2? Or no, they were 3, 3, 6, 8. Or 3, 6, 900 of them. So I need this 1,200 will do. And purchase. Transfer keys. Oh, they're 4,000. Oopsie daisy. I remember there being three. Uh, another 1,200 or... I do have, like... I did the math on it. Like, 90,000 or... So I have a pretty absurd amount of runes. Um, I mean, it seems absurd. It's, like, three levels or something, though. You know? Like, it's not... At this point in the game, it's not an unthinkably large amount of money. I could certainly use it all up by just grinding a couple of levels out, and it wouldn't even be enough to, like, drag me up to the point where I could cast a Gil's Flame. Uh, so, you know, I am being a little cautious. So, you, I also think I don't talk to you anymore. All of you people are quite evil. Uh, hi. Greetings. You're fine. <laughs> yeah, I was. Uh, we already did that, and it she doesn't seem to... hear it from across the wind, past the round table. We've been over this, right? The howling and wailing of spirits in fear of the curse. Yeah. Can you, you should keep your dis... I know you're strong. Yeah, I know. We've been over that. Spirit tuning. Uh, so, yeah, I think the Ancestral Follower, he's been giving me good work. Uh, might be a choice. Uh, and I haven't even really tried Perfume or Trisha. The, uh, the knights are fun. Uh. Oh, yeah, and then I have this flying misbegotten. I keep forgetting he even exists. Uh, okay, well, let's eat another rune. Oh, boy. Uh, let's eat an even bigger one. Like, 16, fucking 2,000, whatever chomp 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 and then level up a couple of those uh, I think I will level up the ancestral follower and you know what <laughs> the original war posse I mean th there's nothing better right I love these guys I'm, I'm dragging them up I'm dragging them all the way up wow that's that's enough so there we go the, them, them because uh, the dogs pissed me off <laughs> In a previous episode, you may remember. Dog's got my goose. They were they're all I need. So there we go. Those those two guys will be on quick switch for now. Um I'm gonna talk to you. I no longer use this guy's services because I am, now that I can afford to be, too good for slavery. Sorry. Uh now that I know someone else who does blacksmithing that isn't a slave. Uh but it doesn't seem like you have anything new to say, so I'm just gonna keep walking. See ya man. And Nephilim, how are you doing? Oh, you. Place. Hi. It's pathetic, I know, but I. I heard from Gideon. Did I? What? I'm sorry. What's Gideon? So you know already, do you? Right. Oh, that's what her father is calling himself. I'm calling him Ulf near the Unknowing. <laughs> Him on the throne of Elden Lord. Oh, not you? Yet I. Though it was not my intent, I betrayed him. Mm -hmm. And I can no longer trust him, Father. There you to go. I think he'd order his men to enact such tragedy. Where is the justice he purports in that? He once told me that if he became Elden Lord, he would never allow the downtrodden to be cheated ever again. Oh, does she mean that village? We, uh, that, 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 um, there was a village of Aurochs or whatever, the, the people who are, like, um, artificial or whatever, made by magic, um, who, that she was, that was being sacked. I guess that was his men. How could I say that? I guess is that what she's implying? always given me his guidance. And now... Does that mean the perfumers and the barbarian guys work for him? Aw, Nephi, you've become crestfallen. No. 
father has now. Okay. Yeah, well, that's that's a uh, that's a pretty irreversible state in my experience, unfortunately. Uh, okay. Well, that's that's I guess all for roundtable hold today. Um. Yeah, sure. No doors have magically opened. Every time I come here, that sort of thing seems to happen. But no, this one is still closed. Something tells me it won't be forever. Uh, and just because... Uh, sorry, what's your name again? I'm so bad with names. <laughs> uh, Roderica. Thank you, Roderica. Now, just because Roderica told me not to, I'm going to go talk to... Uh... <laughs> oh, I guess I'll also pop in on this thing. Ugh. Hi. Seek fingers. Do you have anything to say, fingers? They do not. I don't think. They do not. Uh, do you have anything to say? Receive power from remembrance. That, I need to have, yeah, yeah, that's, no, I'm not going to do that right now. Uh, okay, bye. Bye. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go talk to the, the defiled despoiler guy, just because... The fact that she keeps mentioning him makes me think that maybe there's something to do if I keep poking this bear. Who knows? Let's find out. I can't attack you, you can't attack me, man, so you can spit as many threats as you want. Yeah. Whatever. Okay, he has nothing new to say. Alright, well, then we're done here. Let's go back to where we were. Because, again, we don't fast travel, we just teleport to and from this one location. Uh, whoops, it's over there. Moon gazing grounds. Interesting. That's what we're calling it. All right. All right. But let's uh, let's actually progress, eh? Because so far this episode is basically just been this one boss, and I want to see new things. Oh wait. Uh, sorry. First, I'm just gonna change my potions. Masks. Okay. Masks. Click. 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 Fire pots. Oh. <laughs> Don't want to walk through this door while I'm doing this. Where'd they go? Sorry, what? Huh? Good. Uh, doy. Okay. You got any advice? First off, well done, but why is it always dragon? You serious? You just Are we just back-to-backing the boss fights here? Surely not. Well, I'm not gonna... Three sisters... Hello. What? <laughs> what? It's it seems to be getting further away. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. That's what you call a dragon. Methinks. Well. So we might be getting Nagil's flame sooner than planned. All right. Now we're talking. All right, all right. Well, let's let's get the lay of the land here. Okay, so Three Sisters is the name of the place, or am I about to fight three dragons? What's going on? Okay, we're gonna go this way. So, okay, so yes, I've come out to the the back end of the hold, so to speak. We are back outside now. It's interesting. There's so many like layers to the keep. But, uh, I guess this plateau is considered part of, like, is defended or whatever. Because, like, it's just a back door out this side. If I was going to attack the keep, I'd attack it from this end, you know? But, uh, <laughs> but I guess this plateau is on one of these big cliff rises that we have around here. Yeah, see, this is the kind of thing I was hoping I would now be able to open lock shut for now. But, uh... Completing this little quest did not achieve that goal for me. And I'm becoming a little bit more distraught as to where and how I will procure the magic key that I need. Okay. So I can't get in this building. Alright, fair enough. Let's 
climb back down the hill then, I guess. And what about this ruin? A lot of twinkling magic stuff going on here. Predicting more wizardy bullshit. Boy, yup. Gah. Give me your treasure. Chilling mist. Ooh, that's interesting. It's the second cold based power I've found. Frost is kind of a rare effect in this one. Okay. So, can I just engage this guy, like, anywhere or everywhere here? Where... What, is, he, is there a particular spot he's circling, or is he just like, where is he exactly in relation to all of this ruin and shit? Because this is a weird as hell place to try to fight a dragon. But he seems to be the only thing here. Okay, so he's walking up and down this little hill to... To, to what? To some other tower over there. Ooh. Yeah, he's a big pig. Uh, oh, well, <laughs> guess I should go boss potion back up, eh? Jeez. Man, j j boss to boss to boss today. All right. All right. Well, fine. I'm going to go check out that other corner over there. Um, but otherwise, it does seem like I have the lay of the land here, and it seems like you and me, dragon, are the only thing here. I mean, I, 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 you know, I'm not I, I'm not sure there's no items hidden around or something, but I mean, in terms of dangerous things, uh, which means my thirst for dragon blood calls, calls from deep within my soul. If there's no reason not to, I'm going to slay you. Uh, oh, okay, so that, is there a descent here? No, surely not. Okay, but there is kind of another way to go. I don't think I'll be able to get back down to the normal level. Again, just because of the way that castle is designed. Otherwise, its fortifications make no sense. Oh. <laughs> this is not... No, it's not. This is not that tower over there. It's just a rock formation? Or is there actually something to see over here? This is... Rock form the magic tower disguises a rock formation with the illusionary magic. No, maybe not. Okay, well, fine. All right, give me a second here. I'm I'm gonna rethink my gear and stuff because I guess I mean I guess I don't know if it breathes fire or what. Someone tells me it might be cold, based on the theming here. But either way, I'm gonna go to a slightly more normal gear set and I'm gonna switch myself to to healing potions only. So anyway, see you guys in a few seconds. But Alright, it wasn't the reward we were looking for, but I'll take it as a reward. We're back to our usual outfit, back to Beast Crest Heater Shield, back to the big ol' sword. Let's slay us a dragon. This is this is what I'm I'm born to do. This is this is my purpose in this world. If the one thing that the world can give me is more dragons to kill, I'll take it. Let's slay them. Hey you. Um Okay, now my philosophy does technically allow for chill dragons. It's kind of a weird hypothetical, but such a thing could exist. So, in the name of civility. Sir? Sir, I'm trying to have a conversation with you. And or cut your heart out and then eat it in order to gain dark power. You're, it's really up to you which of those things we do. Oh, I'm so glad. Yes, okay, so he is like a crystal magic dragon. Kind of figured he would be. Okay, that's a fun spell. I knew it had to be something more than just shooting, right? Aha, uh -huh. okay. So it's going to be like that, is it? It's going to be like that. I know this game. Oh. Beast Crest Cheater Shield. Be my guide. I'll fight with passion but become not his prisoner. Ow. Okay, I think I'm... Ow. That's what you call becoming Passion's Prisoner, right there. That's, in that case, Passion is an enormous gout of blue flame. Ah, yeah, yeah, this is why you bring the horse. Man, this is a weird engagement zone for it, though. 
This is going to be a real test of Torrent and my ability to work together. Ah, I'm sorry, and he's gone. It's also going to be a test of Elden Ring's ability to path a creature that flies through unlevel terrain without resorting to the reset creature location to default button. <laughs> it's fine, at least it- Ow! Has that! You know, so it doesn't just like, crash to desktop. At least it's like, it's, it's, it knows when to admit. It's like, yeah, I don't know where it is, or where he's going. I've lost track. I've lost the thread. Can we see that proc? I want that proc. Show me that proc. Let me see that proc. Oh, that song. The proc. There it is. Yup. Yup. <laughs> oh man, that's fun. Gotta love dragon slaying, don't ya? You gotta love it. Because otherwise you'd hate it. Because you gotta do it. There ain't no life but a dragon slayer's life. Ain't no life for me. Yo ho, and a bottle of rum! Where are you going? I'm sorry, what? Coward! Coward dragon! Ugh! G -g 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 Dang it! Ya yeah, Tron Sarn kind of Cinderella Frazzle! That is the second dragon to give me the slip! <sighs> Cowards. Cowards, the lot of them. Who knew that dragons could be cowards? Oh, oh, I, I I'm gonna, I'm gonna switch for it because I know this, this, this calls for a true, a true dejection. <laughs> oh, why? Why beast crest heater shield? Did I become passion's prisoner? Was that the mistake? I know I was fighting with passion. I don't think I became his prisoner. Oh. Well. I mean, that's still kind of a first try, right? Was there something I could have done to stop him from getting away? Surely not. Surely not. Surely not. Right? I don't have any, like... Like those tether harpoons. Did anyone see that movie? What's it called again? Sean Connery is a dragon, and they shoot spears at him with chains tied to it or whatever. Except they don't actually. Or they, yeah, it's a long story. Starring Sean Connery. It's actually a pretty normal length story, I'm pretty sure it's not more than two hours. <laughs> Rannies rise. And here we will fight the boss, surely. No? <laughs> uh, wicked sword ahead. Okay, well... <sighs> Well, that, sorry, I kind of assumed there'd be a fire behind him, but once again, witchy bullshit abounds around every corner. So I, that was, that's too, I mean, it's, it's an anticlimax, but it's a climactic anticlimax. That's too, too good of an ending. First try on a, a big old dragon like that. All right, well, ooh, this place is pretty, ain't it? So, uh, it's cool. I'm enjoying it, but yeah, I can't trust anything or any place. I don't know what's going to happen when I walk through that door. I could be teleported to a totally different zone for all I know. So we're going to hang it up here. Uh, I'm just going to just gonna have a nice sit, and you guys will join me here again next time on Working Project Title, where we will continue our, our, our hunt for the elusive Dragonheart, these wily little sons of bitches. All right, anyway, see you next time. Bye.